Okay, Kel. So, uh, what do you want to do now that uh, we got some time and we own this house? <laughs> I want to get rid of all these stinky mice-smelling cabinets. All oh, these mice-smelling cabinets right here? Yes, I hate them. And you want to make them look like that? Yes, I love those. I think I think that looks a whole lot better than that. Yes. So let's rip and dip. Let's do what? Rip and dip. Rip and dip? What's that slang for? Get rip. Just rip them out. <laughs> rip them out and yeah. put some good stuff in. Yep. Yeah. Should be easy. You think so? When we did those, I thought it was a Saturday project and it was a week project, so this would be two. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So this turned into, well that one turned into uh, like a week project. <laughs> well, no, we, we was, work jobs too, so it it's like not three like... Three days. Three days. Four days. Yeah, three days. But we have jobs too, so, so, so you know, you gotta, you, gotta, you gotta say when you want it to be a week, it's gonna take two. <laughs> what do you think? Maybe we'll get this done tonight. Maybe we'll get this. <laughs> mm, I think so. All right, so that's the plan, guys. So we are gonna take these, all these cupboards out, make it look all Pinteresty up in up in here. Stay and caught up. <laughs> Stay what? Stay caught up. Were you trying to be funny about ketchup? Yeah. <laughs> that was that was a little too corny. Yeah. So if you guys want to see something like that, us ripping these things a new uh, reaper, uh, then stay tuned. <laughs> you like that one? What was that? Reaper. <laughs> Uh, then stay tuned. Be sure to like the video. Maybe subscribe if you want to see more videos like it where we tear things apart and make them look good. All right. Fuel up. So Kel is getting super excited. So we didn't even video taking, starting to take out all the shiznit out of here. <laughs> look at all that. All that doesn't need to be in there. We don't even use it. We don't even use it. Downsize. Time to, to downsize. Time to downsize and, well, we use, you know, baking stuff. Yeah. And the utensils. <laughs> but all of these? Yeah, maybe not all of them. Now we rip them out. And what's behind? Door number one. <laughs> <laughs> are you nervous? No, I'm not nervous. What, are you nervous there's something behind there? Yeah. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. Say these pop out or something? Yeah, if you're strong enough. If I'm strong enough. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Come on. Let us see. Oops. You ever seen this? <laughs> nice. Get a little angry. Oh, it goes up on the back side. Does, so does that count? Ooh, nice. You had to squat with it. <laughs> Did you know you were going to work out? <laughs> Well, we can't get it out of there. Yeah. Oh, you gotta take that. Nice. Come on. Get me out. Get oh. Look there that. you go. <laughs> this is why I'm nervous. What's behind there? Mouse turds. Mouse turds. There's some mouse turds in there for sure. Hey. <laughs> All those spales just get rough housing a little bit. Oh, that's not gonna work that time. There it is. Take this one out too. With the old screwdriver. Ouchie. Go time now. I'm freaking go time, people. Get it. <laughs> Get it. Oh, yeah. There's a bunch of turds. 
Yogurt. We have destroyed all of the cupboards. Paint white all the way there and all the way here along the wall. And then we're thinking this back wall we're gonna do all black. You look like you're in a scary movie right now. You got your big shadow and... <laughs> covering up something? Covering up something dark and secret. <laughs> the crime scene. Yes. Set this guy in here. If you guys can't tell, we didn't have this old style trim, so I ended up uh, using three quarter inch plywood, subfloor actually, uh, and put a nice uh, bevel on here uh, to match up to uh, this old guy. So you can see it looks just like it there. So let's see if it fits. Very tightly, but that'll sit in there. Also, you should come closer. You guys, you guys, come closer, come closer. Check this out. So over here, here, I'll take her. Over here, if you look, along this inside corner. Uh, this is how you should be doing those inside corners. Uh, cutting out, making sure, sometimes you use a coping saw, uh, but I just ended up using a jigsaw. But it matches that that uh, bevel nicely on this one. I made a straight, straight line cut right here and then added a little angle on it on the end there. So, She's turning out. There she be. Nicely. And also, as you can see on the uh, bottom side here, um, I made some of those as well because we didn't have any. Um, I just ended up sanding uh, 
are cutting the three quarter inch plywood and cutting an angle on it. You can kind of see the angle. Uh, I could have rounded that and made it a little bit better looking, but uh, it'll, it'll hide with some paint on it. But that guy just sits down, sits down here, just like so. I gotta cut it, cut it to size, but it sits right in there nicely. Mr. Scrappy. Mr. Scrappy. Or at work. Yeah, you see how hard I'm working? <laughs> it's hard work. Mm, to be a scrapper.
how was this project compared to what you thought it was going to be? Uh, about the similar thoughts. How's the result? Similar. Are you ex so excited? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. Are you going to put your coffee maker on there? Um, I don't drink coffee. <laughs> what are you excited to put on there? Uh, silverware. <laughs> That's your favorite item. Yes, because it gets. I eat food with it. <laughs> That's all we need. <laughs> uh, over and out. Oh. <laughs> you really dressed up for this project. Is this how you're supposed to smile when you're on camera? <laughs> yeah. Awkwardly. How come you just painted one now? No! Okay, you guys, that was our video on making, well, remodeling part two. This number, this is part two of the kitchen remodel uh, in our house. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, be sure to subscribe and so you can see more videos just like it. Maybe we'll see you next time. Also, we're so excited that you guys are following along. We're almost to 100 subscribers. That's pretty neat. It seems like a small number, but we're pretty excited about it. We love each and every one of you.